What is up, YouTube? Hope you guys are having a great Wednesday. Uh, before the video starts, first I'd like to say no Saturday and Sunday videos this week because me and my family are going on a family trip to do the Spartan Race. If you don't know what the Spartan Race is, it's a three and a half mile obstacle course like under barbed wire, over walls, through swampy waters. So we'll see how that goes. I'll show you guys the shirt if I complete it. But so today I want to show you guys a trick that I did last night. I went out for a late night session because I was kind of irritated and I believe I invented a trick. I'm sure you guys can tell me there's a name for it or tell me who already did it but if you do that that's the fine but for today it's a trick I invented and we're gonna go through the steps of everything how I did my creative process and see if you guys can maybe do it. So let's get right into the video. Alright, so the whole premise of this trick is like half a no comply to a weird spin roll away. So, not much more to describe. But if you guys can name it, that'd be great. But, let's get into the steps that I took to actually land this. So the first thing you're going to start off with is doing half the no comply. When you push down, you're going to drag the tail on the ground until it rotates partially around, but hold it there. Don't let it pop like an actual no comply front 180. The second part of this is grabbing the nose. So let's lower the angle and show you what I mean. So when the board is up like this, what you want to do is your weight is already going to be shifted back. So as you come shifting forward, don't grab this side of the nose. If you do, you're going to end up landing right in wheel bite. It doesn't work. So what you want to do is grab this side of the nose and rotate this direction. So you grab the nose and you rotate 270. And as you're finishing up, 270 degree rotation is when you want your foot to come back and set it down because then you'll be rolling straight so let's see if I can actually land one for you guys and use it as a reference and hopefully you guys can do this So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm in a lot of pain. New rotations are always painful for me. I don't know about you guys. So like my first 360 really hurt my shoulders. And in two hours, it seems like I only got one landed. So I guess there's two total in the video, but I was hoping to land more. Last night, I landed a few of them. It took 15 minutes, didn't fall once, and it was perfect. Today, I, I don't know what it is. But thanks for liking, commenting, and subscribing. And as always, guys, have a great day.